kids, I'm back with another toy. This time I got the amazing kinetic fan. It's Dino Dig Fossil's Dino. The tray's behind. So let's take a look at the back of the box. So let's open it up and see what we get inside. This is what we get. We get the tray. And we also get the fan right here. Here we have the mold. We have a dinosaur here, a dinosaur here, a dinosaur here, and we have a dinosaur here. Let's just stop everything out. Here's the tray. So let's take a look at the fan. Let's set this up, okay? We have to insert the panel in here. Here we have the sand. As you play with it and mold it, it oozes. It kind of has a movement to it. It's supposed to clean up really easily. And you know what it does? Look at this. Look how it oozes. Here's the other kinetic sand. Should we pour it? Yeah, pour it next to this. Here's the next one. There are two colors included, a blue and an orange. This one doesn't ooze so much. Because you have to uh, mold, you have to work it a bit. This one you mix it and then it oozes. Then you can mold it. What else can you do with it? You, you can clean it up. It cleans up really easy. I love that. And it never dries up. So we're, we have a divider for the two because we don't want to mix up the colors. So here, let's move the blue on this side. You can shape it into a ball. And it stays together. Right here. And we can throw it. And it never breaks. Okay. Look how it oozes and it breaks apart so nicely. Kinetic sand is amazing. Yeah, yeah, you can also break it yourself. It's so cool. You can shape it up. But we put it in the meat. Push it to make it. And then you take it out, then that's what you get. Chop, chop, chop. And it's very easy to break. And you can mold it into shapes. So let's go ahead and mold it into different shapes. So let's press it in. And look at that. We'll take off the extra pieces. And I've made a little dino. We can use a hammer to break it up. Once you let it sit, it just oozes. It has a flow to it. Let's see if we can find the fossil I've hidden in here. We're going to use the pickaxe for that. That's really fun. Digging through, you can even use your fingers. But it's definitely more fun to use the pickaxe. And here it is. We found our fossil. Let's play a little with the blue sand. And you can have a lot of fun with it. Let's use our different mold. We're going to use this dinosaur mold. Let's hide a fossil in it. We'll put a little bit of blue sand. Pat it in. Let's put our fossil in and then cover it up with sand so we can make a fossil find just like this. Now let's clean up the extra one that fell off. As you can see, here's our mold that we've made. Let's use the pickaxe. And there it is. 
see this one ooze. The more you work it, the more it oozes. Look at this. Ooh. And it pours out. It's super fun. It's filled with air bubbles, I think. But here I made a ball and I can actually toss it. it. Doesn't come apart. However, if I set it down and leave it for a bit, it's going to start oozing like this one. Here's our dinosaur egg and it's cracking. Here's our other ball that we've made. It's really starting to come apart. It's already starting to crack. As you can see, it's moving. I think the shape that I put inside is holding it together. But when you crack it open, you find a little fossil. Super fun. Well, that's it for us, guys. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe, and watch more videos by clicking the I above. Bye, everybody.